What is going on guys? It is Dunk back for another video and today we are checking out the buzz around Pi Network. It seems to be that some of these uh, foreign exchanges, namely Huobi, uh, Bitmark, Bitmark, xt.com which i believe is a decentralized exchange and some of these other uh, foreign exchanges have listed pi as a token to be purchased on exchange now the biggest thing to note today is these are uh, similar to perpetual contracts they do not have any liquidity uh, for the Pi tokens themselves, and these are more of a paper IOU. And the biggest indicator of this is none of these exchanges um, are actually trading at the same amounts. There is no consistency in the price. Uh, as you can see here, we are about 250 40 bucks on Huobi. Uh, XT.com was trading around 20 to $17. So a very big disparity between pricing. And if you go over here, they listed this token on the 29th and this is not something officially supported by the Pi team. If you hop over to Pi's social blade, this just tracks their social scores, um, their follower gain. The day before, or excuse me, days leading up to the launch of the token on Huobi, you can see their Twitter followers gained quite a bit um, over here. And this actually forced the Pi team themselves to come out with a note saying, they do not support these tokens listed on the exchanges. So hopping into this note from these folks, Pi Network is aware of reports that several unauthorized third-party exchanges and potentially unknown third parties are seeking to list Pi in tokens uh, purporting to be Pi or some purported derivative of Pi without the consent or authority or the involvement of the Pi Network. Uh, just right off the bat here, guys, the Pi team is located over at Stanford University in California. It looks to be just these two individuals, uh, Dr. Nicholas uh, Kokalis and Dr. Fan, running the project, and that appears to be the entire team. So based on that, let's take a look at what's actually going on their Twitter. Uh, they have a sticky all the way back from November 14th of 2020, just thanking you for breaking uh, 2 million Twitter followers, uh, which is a very big achievement. And then they listed this, uh, excuse me, they retweeted this um, announcement that they were not involved in these exchange listings. And if you go down a little further, not a whole lot is going on. So they did announce a hackathon in early December, which was two weeks before the last tweet. And then we're going back another week here uh, for updates to the KYC on their app. And then it looks like we just start falling off with activity. So a bunch of retweets, a retweet from August, um, another retweet um, down here from July of 2007, just not a ton of activity with the project. So what does that actually mean? I'm not quite sure. Do we lean into the theory that these third parties are pumping the token for a potential listing and coming into mainnet? But let's further explore this note from the team. Uh, it's important to reiterate that Pi is currently in closed network. It is not approved by Pi Network for listing of any of the changes for trading. And Pi Network was not involved with any of these purported postings or listings. Currently, Pi Network recommends to all pioneers and potential Pi users not to engage with any of these exchanges or third-party actors as their actions are not affiliated with Pi Network and could result in substantial losses or damage to Pi users. Pi Network is also requesting that these posts and exchange listings removed and evaluate additional actions with respect to the third parties and exchanges. In the interim, it is important to reiterate that the transactions of Pi through an exchange is explicitly prohibited during the enclosed mainnet period. In doing so, would violate Pi's policy. So currently, the Pi network is an enclosed ecosystem. There is no way to take your tokens off the enclosed ecosystem, move them to one of these exchanges that list the token, and actually sell your tokens. So any of these influences out there that are saying buy Pi, not a good move in the current state of affairs. Uh, the unique innovations designed of Pi enclosed network network period is strategic choice to build a network of true substance and utility with the best interests of the network, the community, and the individual pioneers in mind. The current enclosed network period of mainnet allows Pi to focus on two priorities, mass KYC, migration, and ecosystem utility building. Both are essential steps forward uh, of our ultimate objective of building a viable ecosystem to get ready for open mainnet. 
For additional information concerning Pi Network, our policies, please see the official published contents in the links below. So it looks like uh, they don't support any of these listings, listings. They have not provided any liquidity. There is no back-end connections into their network. These are essentially all paper IOUs from these exchanges such as Huobi. So very dangerous to dump, jump in this pump unless you are a trader uh, looking to play the speculative market here. I do not suggest buying this token on any of these exchanges. If you want to hop into the official Pi ecosystem, you just take the links over here from Pi Network on their official Twitter page. Click the mindpi.com. That'll bring you right to their homepage. And I'm just going to give you their brief overview of the project, although it does not explain a whole lot. The future of money is evolving rapidly, and no one wants to be left behind. Mining Bitcoin is time and energy intensive, requires extensive physical resources, and advanced technical knowledge. Introducing Pi, the first and only digital currency you can mine on your phone. That's big. This novel approach, developed by Stanford PhDs, allows you to mine cryptocurrency on your phone by leveraging your existing social connections with no cost and no battery drain. Have a phone? You've got Pi. It's time to join the revolution. Download Pi today for Apple or Android and get your piece of the Pi. So full disclosure, I have not downloaded this app. I was more interested in the buzz around the coin itself. But if you do download the app, there is a KYC process. It does appear to have a daily reminder to harvest your Pi tokens off the mining application. And <clears throat> there's just not a whole lot of information on this website quite yet. So I don't know how I feel about this. Let me know if you're leaning in to the hype around Pi. Did you download the official app? Are you buying it on one of these speculative exchanges? I'm just not sure. So other than that, their website is pretty plain Jane. The so Pi nodes, here's the Pi Explorer, the mobile app technology, just with a contact us page, asking you to download from Android or the app store, the platform itself here, they have some nice SDKs for the developers, and then they have a demo here, um, which you can't really seem to click on uh, for their app. But I'm going to wrap it up there, guys. Let me know what you think about the hype around the Pi ecosystem. Just keep in mind that you cannot move uh, your internal Pi app coins off to one of these exchanges to sell for profit. Uh, these guys seem to be, Huobi themselves, some of these other third-party exchanges, seem to be just um, heading into a pump and dump uh, issue here with Pi. We are up 400. Man, we went up pretty high here. So let's get a, a proper measurement. Let me go out here just on the 15 minutes. So listed at, just say zero here. And we went all the way up. I mean, that's pretty ridiculous. So a couple thousand percent. I got to go the other way. All right, guys. I'm just going to start from a dollar. So we are up 26,000%. So anybody who actually jumped in on this pump, congratulations. You made quite a bit of money. Uh, we can chart this out and see if it's worth hopping into Hobie and buying uh, any additional pumps. Uh, I don't know if they have... Uh, shorts and longs in on this or if it's just a spot token but let's wrap it up there guys let me know what you think of the pi token let me know what you think of these third-party exchanges uh, listing this token uh, essentially without the blessing from the pi team don't forget to like and subscribe and join us in discord the link is below